Hi Capricorn, this is Jeffrey. This is Red Color. This is your reading for the week of October 10th through the 17th. Uh, please like, subscribe, share, comment, press the bell for notifications. For uh, personal readings, I also offer via Zoom or via or in person. I'm in Midtown, Manhattan. <clears throat> I took a little coffee break in the middle of reading, so happy, happy. All right, um, I also offer IET, which is a healing modality. Uh, the information is below. Please visit my website, rightcolor.com, where I have uh, astrology t-shirts and scarves, et cetera, et cetera. And uh, I'm also on Instagram. I'm not as active on Instagram as I used to be, but I do have a pretty feed, I must say. It's no words, it's just pictures. Oh, do I have to read the whole book? It's like, no, let's just look at the pictures. Okay. Let's go. Okay, Capricorn, what's going on for you? One, two, three. Okay. You know, you're Capricorn. You're going to take responsibility. That's what you do. That's what you do. The past is somehow going to inform you as to how to move forward in the future. So there might have been an experience in the past that you have recollection of or a memory of, and um, it's going to make it's going to help you to. Um, Hmm. Be move forward in a very stable, um, in a very uh, practical whoop, way. Gather your strength. There's a certain um, constriction in a way, but I think it's really good. I think it's really good. I, you know, it, it, it's uh, really understanding the boundary, really understanding the amount of money you have, the amount of work you have, like really getting it and organizing it. I'm really feeling that, I'm really feeling that. And being able to direct the energy toward where it needs to go. And I think that the past has really made you very clear, stability, stability, stability. Okay. Yeah, you know what? That's what it is. This, in the past, it wasn't like that. In the past, it was like a, a big uh, conflama, chaotic. And I feel like, or maybe that was your experience and you're remembering that and saying, oh, no, no, I'm not going down that road. You know, I'm not getting out involved with these people. I'm not going to gamble with something. I'm not going, I, I'm going slow and steady, move forward, you know, uh, even, and I'm going to tame myself. I'm going to tame, I'm going to uh, direct the energy, direct the thought, to, you know, take responsibility and direct it. Like, I'm really feeling that. Clarity. Clarity. Yeah, because you you really you 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 know exactly what went down, and and it's really clear now. And it's like, oh no 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 no, I I already did that. No. So, uh, if something needs to be cut out, if somebody needs to be cut out, then you don't have a problem doing it, which is really good. Yep. Here we go. The surgeon. The surgeon, right? Cut out the fat. Everything that's unnecessary goes. So you know, I um, I have Virgo rising. <laughs> so I got this new thing. I got this right, which my old one, whatever. So it took me three days to like completely go through everything, and you know, I'm looking through things, and it's like you haven't used this now long. Goodbye. This isn't my way. Goodbye. 
you know, this is the past, goodbye. You know, this is too big, goodbye. I need to make room for like new. And I really feel like that's what's going on. It's almost like a spring cleaning in the fall because you already have the experience and the memory of um, the past that was uh, very chaotic and not organized and not um, practical. And uh, it might've been um, sort of a, it might have been also, you know, sometimes you get involved with people and they can be very needy and very, um, they draw on your energy and you know, like, oh, I ain't playing that, I ain't playing. I already met you, I already know who you are, even though we just met, I, you, rem, you know, you're just like somebody else. And I am not getting involved with your, uh, instability because you know that was a lesson that i learned really well and i am not up to learning that lesson again i learned it i got it i have the diploma i graduated i graduated and now i just want to do my work and be in my work and perfect my skill and become the expert that I am with no distractions. I'm not interested in distractions because I have bigger plans. This could really be like, uh, it's really a me first sort of energy, which is great. It's great. I feel very empowered with you and, and you know, Sometimes, you know, we get soft and we get soft with the wrong people, right? I've been there. You get soft with the wrong people. It's like, no, 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 direct it. No, direct it, right? Be warm and loyal and kind with the right people, namely you and uh, the other people who are around who are, I don't know why I'm getting all this, you know, you, you see them for who they are, so cut them right out. Because otherwise, you know, you're going to, you know, revisit the catastrophe. Please. I already saw that movie. All right. That's what I got for you. That's what I got. I think it's really good. I think it's really good. I think it really, um, sometimes the courageous thing is to say no. Sometimes the courageous thing is to say no. Sometimes the courageous thing is to not be involved with people who, uh, or situations that you already know the outcome before it even began. So, you know, oh, well, I owe something to you. I owe something to my tribe. I owe something to my ex. I owe something to my blood relative. No, you don't. I'm gonna leave it at that. Blessings.